Your Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, it's my great honor to participate for the eighth time at this important meeting, even if only in a virtual way. I would like to express my high respect to His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum for having taken the initiative for creating such an important global platform for governments shaping the future. I also want to congratulate Dubai for having organized such a successful World Expo despite all the repercussions of the global pandemic. Last November, in partnership with His Excellency Mohammed Al Gargawi, we brought together 60 top intellectual thinkers here in Dubai. Thank you to His Excellency for enabling this initiative to define a longer-term narrative to make the world more resilient, more inclusive and more sustainable. With all the current issues on our agenda, we tend to forget that we are in the midst of the fourth industrial revolution, which accelerates global change in much more comprehensive and faster ways than the previous three revolutions. I'm proud that the government of Dubai has been so foresighted in establishing a center for the fourth industrial revolution in cooperation with the World Economic Forum. The objective is to quickly recognize the potential of new technologies as well as develop the necessary ethical and political frameworks around those new technologies to ensure that those technologies are human-centered and society-oriented. The world has to overcome not only the damage done to our economies and our societies by COVID-19, it also has to confront the repercussions of a dangerous clash between major global powers. History is truly at a turning point. We do not yet know the full extent and the systemic and structural changes which will happen. However, we do know that global energy systems, food systems and supply chains will be deeply affected. In times of crisis, the role of governments is more important and more relevant than ever. What is also needed is a summit like this one to go beyond crisis management and to look into constructive ways we can build our common future. Our futures are intrinsically connected to one another as the profound challenges to mankind such as climate change are globally interconnected and require collaborative responses. In conclusion, and despite all the challenges, we have to uphold our responsibility which we have towards the next generation and which we can only fulfill through collaboration on a national and on a global level. I wish you an impactful and successful meeting.